Hey everyone, so today is a pretty fun day. Um, we have Ethan's senior semi. So our last semi dance tonight. And I decided I'm just gonna vlog it because I think it would be fun for you guys to see. I just got a shower, obviously, as you can tell. I lotioned my legs and I have a bunch of other things to do before three o'clock, which is when I'm going to Ethan's. We're getting pictures. And then we're going out to my friend Tess and Taylor's, the other two girls from this channel, out to their house to get other pictures before going to the dance. And then after the dance, I think I'm going to my friend Carmen's house um, just to hang out with them. So I thought it would be fun to show you guys what I'm doing. So yeah, stay tuned for what happens. I bought these stick-on nails to put on because... I'm a broke college student and I do not have money or time to go get my nails professionally done and I'm just going to do my own hair and makeup since, you know, like I just said, I am broke college student. I'm going to wait for my hair to air dry a little bit and then I'm going to blow dry it the rest of the way so that it's mostly straight and then straighten it. Usually I curl my hair for these dances, but I decided the last one i'm not gonna waste my time curling my hair because that's what i always do i want to do something different so i'm gonna straighten it and then i'll show you guys my dress and what my makeup looks like and what my nails look like after that's all done i just painted my toenails and i realized i was gonna do my nails but i realized i should probably wait and do that like last after I'm done doing my hair and everything just so that they're not like popping off since obviously they're just stick on nails compared to like actual acrylics. So now I'm just moisturizing my face since it's really dry and then I'm gonna blow dry my hair and then straighten it. So yeah. <laughs> from doing my hair and makeup and stuff and getting ready to pop some Ooh, I just dropped it on the floor but drop I dropped an ibuprofen but to pop some ibuprofen because my belly hurts probably because I just chugged a Red Bull I don't know why I did that but I chugged it and now hopefully these ibuprofens can help me not feel as sick as I do right now because I don't want my stomach to hurt all night and if my stomach hurts all night and I'm dancing around it would probably just get worse so yeah that's like the only medicine I usually take I usually only take ibuprofen I don't really take anything else because ibuprofen seems to work I don't really take medicine that often anyways but like tonight since I know that I'm gonna be doing stuff I don't want to feel like terrible all night usually I just like lay down and let it ride out you know feel better but hopefully this works fast so while I wait for my straightener to warm up I'm gonna tell you a little story that happened today so today um earlier before I got a shower and stuff I went to the dollar store to get those stick on nails and some more mascara since I ran out and I went with my mom and we were behind this lady in line and she bought like practically the whole entire um Halloween clearance so her bill was like over a hundred dollars took like 20 minutes for her to check out and then it was finally our turn we paid we left and I was telling my mom the story and I was getting heated about it and then out of nowhere this car just comes like I'm driving on the main road and this car comes flying down this hill doesn't even stop at the stop sign and I almost hit them. Like, I was, like, this close to hitting them. It was an old man. I, like, laid on the horn. And they just, like, looked at me. Like, no no emotion at all. They are just, like... So then, I didn't really know what to do. I started backing up. He started backing up. And then I drove away. 
and then he drove away and then I was like should I pull over like to make sure we didn't actually hit my mom was like no like it should be fine because he would have heard it we would have felt it and I was like okay true but like I just got a new car like not even a month ago like literally three weeks ago today I got a new car and I was like wow that would have sucked like because technically it's it wasn't my fault because he didn't stop at the stop sign and he like pulled out in front of me but yet the way that it was I would have hit him so it would have been my fault and my insurance already went up because I got a new car and everything but it would go up even more and that would have sucked so I'm just glad that like I was able to slam on the brakes we didn't hit each other and I'm just I didn't know how to feel I really didn't know how to react so I just like started laughing like I kept laughing and I couldn't stop laughing I just thought it was so funny so that was my story I I'm really surprised that like I didn't hit him but yeah glad I'm my car's in one piece and we didn't hit each other because that would have sucked depending on how like fast we were both going like Maybe I wouldn't even be able to go to semi tonight. Maybe I'd be in the hospital or something. But thank God that didn't happen. So I just finished straightening my hair. And I kind of want to do something else to it since it's like plain. But like I don't know what I want to do. I did just try to do a little braid in it, but it looked ridiculous, so I don't know. I also thought about maybe, like, putting, like, half of it up into, like, a little ponytail, but maybe if it comes down to it, I'll just have, like, Tessa put a little braid in it or something, so it's not as plain, but for now, I'm just gonna leave it like this and see how it works out. Makeup time! So, I, like, scrubbed my neck because it looked dirty. Maybe it was just me being crazy, but now I have this, like, huge red spot, so hopefully it goes away soon. But I'm just gonna... I'm not good at makeup at all, if you know me. So I'm just gonna do some eyeshadow, some foundation that probably doesn't even match my skin tone. Just do whatever to make myself look a little bit more presentable. So I will show you what it looks like when I'm done, because I'm probably just not gonna do it on camera just in case I'm doing anything wrong which I probably am I don't know how to do makeup I just do whatever and hope it comes out good so I don't need anybody hating on me for doing it wrong so I will show you the finished look once I'm done so I did my makeup I don't really know how I like it I'm not into like dark colors I think it's because my hair is so light that it's like weird to have dark colors but, yeah, I feel like I look like Casper the Ghost, like, I can't tell. I don't think this really, like, matches my skin, but, eh. and, like, that red mark is still there, so hopefully that goes away. I'm putting on plum lipstick then, because my dress is black, and to, like, just add color, I'm wearing, like, plum lipstick, so I want to brush my teeth before... I put that on obviously and then all I have to do is get dressed into my dress and leave so yeah I don't even know what time it is it's like getting close to like 2 30 I think and I'm going to Ethan's for three o'clock so I have a little bit of time to just chillax and make sure I have everything for Carmen's I need to pack quick so yeah I'll show you what I pack then I guess it's been a little while now um my hair is straight, my makeup's done. I just put in these silver hoops. I put my Apple Watch on. I put these freaking nails on that look ridiculous, but whatever. You're not really going to be able to see them. I got these rings from my mom that are kind of a little big for my ring finger. Maybe I'll have to move them. And I put on my dress. So it's just this black sparkle dress. And the back is so cute. Let me show it to you. So don't mind my messy room in the background, but this is the dress, full in its glory. And then this is what the back looks like. So it's all like cut out in the back. I love it. Like it's so cold out today. It's like 
40 degrees, so I'm gonna freeze outside getting pictures, but at least inside when everyone's in there dancing around, it's gonna be hot and I'm gonna be fine because I'm barely covered, so. Yeah, um, I'm gonna straighten over my hair again quick so that it's like sh all the way straight. Then I'm going to Ethan's to get pictures. So I will check back with you guys when I get to Ethan's. Also, I forgot I packed for Carmen's. I have a shirt to wear tomorrow at work. There's already jeans in there, stuff to sleep in. I just have to grab my charger and my contact stuff. And yeah, that's about it all in this little bag my shoe keeps coming untied so finally i was like f it and double knotted it so it better not come out <laughs> i'm annoyed already like this one was perfectly fine this one did not come untied but this one just keeps coming untied and now that i say that this one's probably gonna come untied so i should probably just double knot this one but yeah semi ready here's taylor do a little twirl <laughs> Good, good. Tessa, twirl. Good. Savannah, look here, I'm vlogging. Get up and twirl around. Show me your fit. Wow, nice, nice. There's Ethan. Look here, Ethan. Smile. He just loves semi. Look at your fit. Ooh, ooh. And the mullet. Look at the mullet. Ooh. Look at that butt. Ooh. Yeah. Everyone else. Ooh. Whoa, that's cool. I zoomed out on the video. That's cool. I already lost a nail. Wow. 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 Almost leaving to go to semi. Look at Taylor over there. Taylor. Tessa. Ethan. not going to Carmen's I just came home and slept because I was tired so yeah I'm gonna end up the vlog here I hope you enjoyed the little bit that I was able to vlog during um semi the actual dance and every other thing that I vlogged before then hope you enjoyed and um I'll see you in my next video bye